Yo, it's your boy D's Midi back again with another video. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel on the road to 100K. Today, we're going to talk about that boy Rollo Fam Goon. Uh, he just got released after doing six years in prison for uh, got caught by the feds or the DEA, one of those task force, called him smuggled a million dollars worth of marijuana from Cali all the way to the A. You know what I'm saying? He had them apartments booming. But, uh, man, today we're going to talk about him. Waste no time. That man ain't been home six hours, bro. He didn't drop a snippet already, man. He going at Yo Gotti neck, which ain't no stranger. You know what I'm saying? He been, him and Dolph been cool way before Dolph passed. He been dissing Black Youngster. You can even go way, way back. Him and Money Back, Yo got into it. So I can see why, you know, he got a little, little hard feelings towards CMG. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, bro, you better be careful, bro. And the feds is still watching you, bro. So you got to watch what you do. But this could be a trolling one. He could be using this to, you know, you know, to, you know, get a quick little clout and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Even though I feel like at this point in his career, he don't really got to. But maybe, you know, you know, he's showing his love for Dolph and this is the way he going to do it. But, uh, you know, a dangerous game, bro, because as we've seen on plenty of instances, bro, man, you know, Gotti got them niggas around him, bro. So you got to be careful with how, how you play with uh, Gotti, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not saying nothing like that. I hope it don't get to that point. But you did, this is what I try to tell the kids, man. You know, when y'all in the microphone and y'all in the booth and you around your homies and all of that, and niggas is geeking you up and you feel like you big and bad to say that, them, 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 them sneak disses and all of that, that, that drilling, all that shit on them songs, Please believe it when a motherfucker catch you, bro. You better be able to stand on that, bro. And this is why I feel like a lot of people, bro, got too much talent, bro. Like, I feel like people put themselves in situations when it really don't have to be that. Like, yeah, we get it, Rollo. You know, you fuck with Dolph. That's your mans and all of that. But, bro, unless you really, really, really ready to go all out and lose it all, bro, bro, you might as well make your money, bro. Take care of your family, bro. You know what I'm saying, bro? You got an opportunity of a lifetime, bro. You got you got six years for getting caught with a million dollars worth of weed, bro. That right there is damn near unheard of, bro. It's a lot of motherfuckers who doing 10 years for getting caught with an ounce or a, a nickel bag or some shit like that, bro. So, man, just be blessed. Be thankful, man, and enjoy your, your life, bro. You just did six years. Enjoy the time with your kids, your wife. Go get you some, bro. You diss a nigga probably for you even go fuck something, bro. Like, what? I don't get it, bro, with this generation, bro. It's crazy, bro. Crazy, bro. You probably ain't even gonna get no ass, bro. You already... <laughs> and you already dissing, bro. But it's your boy, D's Media Signing Now, Y'all let me know in the comment section what y'all think.